What's up y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I want to do a video on my baby boy's nursery room. I have everything put together and stuff and I didn't get to get a chance to um, show you guys his room and stuff. I really love how it turned out. Hopefully I can um, give you guys some ideas, something simple. Um, I guess it's maybe modern-ish or I don't even know how you would explain this room, like a natural feel to it. You guys will see what I'm talking about. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and show you guys his nursery room. Okay, so when you first walk in to the room, you pretty much first see um, the setup pretty much. He, his room is small anyways, but to the right here, once you enter, um, the room is, uh, this awesome lamp that I got from Ikea. So I'm just going to walk over here and stuff, but, um, I absolutely love this lamp. It's super like, I love the natural tones and stuff. And it's like, to me, it's like kind of modern and stuff. And then, we come over here um, and we have the animals and everything like that. So um, I actually found these pictures on like Google. So like I just typed in like um, just like the animals that were the like the animals that I was looking for and stuff. And then um, I pretty much edited some of them to get a better quality. And then I took the images. Well, I saved it onto my phone and I took the images to Walmart and got them printed out. So that's a great way to save some money to save your coin because you don't have to go on Amazon and like, you know, purchase like a $40 thing of these types of animals and stuff like that. So really loved how this came out. Um, a cheaper way, um, like people get the Ikea, um, the Ikea picture frames and stuff. And they're not that, like, that expensive, but a definitely cheaper alternative is go to your local Dollar Tree store. Go to Dollar Tree, and you guys, this is where I bought it from. The Dollar Store. Good old Dollar Tree. <laughs> so, going down from here, um, I have my son's um, dresser and stuff. And um, this is from Ikea. I actually found this on... The Facebook market have for cheaper so if you have uh, Facebook and stuff um, go on your Facebook market see what you can find and stuff I got it for cheaper and everything so that was a steal and then I just have some stuffed animals and like some cute stuff um, that either um, we that my parents got and everything like that my parents actually got this uh piggy bank thing of puma <laughs> so super cute um and then i have all his um so far his books and everything like that i definitely recommend this book the daddy edition super cute i gifted that to my husband when um we chose uh travel's name and everything like that um, these books, um, my first Batman book, and then I have my first Superman book. Um, I found these at Home Goods. So, um, Home Goods does have a kid books, baby books, and all that good stuff. Um, and then we move on to his shoes. Um, he is one spoiled boy. Um, so far he can fit into these ones. Um, these are super, super cute. And he has Adidas and his Nikes, Air Force Ones and stuff. Found these at Ross. Um, which was funny because um, I seen a girl was returning them. And it caught my eye and everything like that. And when my parents were down here, we actually, I actually asked the girls, like, are you returning those and stuff? And she said, yeah. So I, we ended up getting those. Um, then, um, I need to clean this. So sorry for the marks and stuff. But you guys, I got this at Walmart. So I was super obsessed because the detailing of the wood, the wooden accent on here just matches. It just matches everything and stuff. Um, it's round, so it's different, not like, you know, your regular mirrors that you usually find and stuff. So I really, really love how that, like, ties the stuff together and everything like that. I was going to put um, his 
diaper changing pad up here, but we still have that in his in in our room. So um, I just ended up putting his shoes on display because I mean. He's a boy, and I, I don't know. I just feel like having those these shoes on display was cute. So that's where I put them at. <laughs> and then um, I guess I'll go and show you his drawers. So since this was going to be a, a changing station, I did have wipes and stuff. But what I ended up doing is putting his onesies that he pretty much wears to sleep and stuff that, um, that cover, like, his hands. That way he don't scratch himself and, like just the footy onesies so that's in that drawer and i do have sorry i do have like the covers i got these from ikea um super reasonable good price and stuff just to be a little more organized and try to be organized um got some more in here to check check his temperature and stuff so we got that in here cute little mustache passy and stuff um this next drawer so he has a lot of these bibs and stuff because he's always drooling. I actually need to use more of these because I feel like they just stay in the store. But um, they're super cute um, and everything. Got some mittens. Um, the only mittens that really stay on is this pair. Um, the rest, they come off really easily. But anyways, um, and then I have socks in here. Pretty much put them, like almost my favorite pairs of socks, which is funny to say, but... I mean, you know, I love these tones and stuff. Um, right next to it, I have all his hats. So I try to keep all that stuff together. Next drawer. These, this drawer is kind of like the miscellaneous one. Like um, the ultrasounds and all that stuff that you see here. Going down, I have pretty much this is his bath station and everything like that. Once he gets a bath, his towels. These are his cloths to um, pretty much just, you know, get his um, birthing, burping cloth, the small one. The next drawer, I have his little footprints. Look how cute. I need to get a frame because I want to frame it. Um, and then I have swaddles. We don't really swaddle him. He always gets out of it anyways, but we, we did use it in the beginning. Then we have more burping cloths. These are bigger ones and stuff. So that's that drawer. Coming over here, I pretty much have every drawer like <laughs> filled up. But um, I try to organize this drawer and stuff. I do. I, I am using the IKEA um, container stuff. So this is all the newborns' um, outfits and um, shorts and onesies and stuff. Then I have the zero to three months. These are all his sweatpants. So he has a lot of sweatpants. Um, some of these are in bigger size as well. And then we have another, like, I guess you can, I'm going to say like a little station, a little spot for his socks and everything like that. Look how cute these are. I'm so obsessed. <laughs> and then we have more onesies, zero to three months or three months. So he's actually wearing zero to three months and three months right now. And he's not even two months yet. <laughs> Craziness. Then this is my crazy drawer. <laughs> Um, I did have it organized, but yeah, I feel like there's, there's no way I can keep this organized at all. I just, sometimes I just grab and just like, just throw it back in there. <laughs> so yeah, that's his clothes that I have in there. So that's this whole station right here. Then over here is just his bath, um, thing, um, tub and stuff that I probably should just put in his, um, his little closet um to get a better view of this room um i got this nice rug from target if i can find it um i'll link it down below if you guys are interested but it went so well with the room and everything um these abc blocks um I got it from Hobby Lobby. So I actually use these for um, the baby shower. It came out so nice and I was able to reuse them for his room and stuff and then just added a cute little teddy bear on top. So um, all this stuff I'll try to link down below if you guys are interested. Um, but yeah, I really love this. It really brings a room together and just really cute. Um, this next thing that I have is his uh, crib. Um, 
so you can get all this on Amazon. Um, my husband's mom got us a crib and everything. And then I found this cute little blanket, knitted blanket um, at TJ Maxx. And then um, this fitted sheet for the bed is from Amazon. Um, and the changing pad um, is also a matching set with, with the crib um, sheet right here. So if you want the matching set, I'll link it down below as well. And then a <laughs> cute little basketball in here. And then I found this at um, this cute little sign thing at Home Goods as well. Y'all, Home Goods has some really bomb stuff there. So I just kept it with um, when he was born and everything like that with how much he weighed and you know how long he was. So that is the setup right here. On the wall, I also um, printed out the. Um, the animals from um, from Google and stuff and printed out at Walmart and the picture frames I didn't get them at Dollar Tree but I got them at Walmart I think they were like six bucks each so I just had two big big ones 16 by 20 is the size of these and um, then I have his name above his crib so this is what it's looking like um, I got his name made um what is that I'll link it down below I honestly forgot like which app I think oh gosh I got it done um I got it made from Etsy so someone from Etsy makes them and stuff and I think we paid like 30 something dollars for it so we hang that up and it's honestly super super cute and you can see the tones and like the natural tones and I feel like it just makes the room bright to me and just like calming it like calms me down I'll come in this room and like it calms me down and then we have in the corner is his laundry basket which I'm upset because it's a obsessed because it's a wicker basket and super cute so got his clothes in there and then I just have more of his clothes hanging up and stuff and then just a mess at the bottom to be honest and then we just have some diapers and everything like that. So I actually need to bring this one probably downstairs because I got two of them and I think I need the bigger one <laughs> downstairs. So yeah, you guys, that, yeah, you guys, so that is his room. Honestly, it's just super simple. I didn't want to go with a theme that was just blue for a boy and stuff. I really thought about it. And um, this, these were like the tones that I honestly was just wanting and actually like for a home and stuff. So um, yeah, I really love how everything turned out. Um, I will link everything down below if you're interested in where I got the items from and stuff. So um, yeah, let me know if, uh, you guys, I like this nursery room. Um, let me know if, um, yeah, let me know if you like this nursery room. Go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up, a big like, um, comment down below and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and everything. I truly appreciate once you guys subscribe to my channel. So uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and leave this video here. I hope you guys liked everything and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.